hello guys in this video tutorial i'm going to show you how to get free domain and hosting so before starting the tutorial uh, i want to clear this that this hosting cannot be used for professional website like if you want to build an e-commerce website or for your business etc so you cannot use it you can use it but uh, as you know in free hosting there are some uh, shoes you can say uh, we cannot uh, use our website properly in free hosting so in order to get a complete website for your business or for anything that you need a professional website so you need a premium uh, hosting plus domain so i will also add hosting and domain link from where you can buy in this video description but you can also use uh, actually this website the purpose of this is you will be able to learn many script many cms like wordpress let's suppose if you don't know how to use wordpress uh, if you want to experiment on wordpress and other cms so you can use this free hosting what you have to do is uh, type pro free host in google or you can directly visit profreehost.com click on this link and you can also read all advantages of this free host like they provide unlimited disk space unlimited bandwidth mysql database and these all things so click on the register now button and type here your mail actually i already created an account that's why they say that you need to verify your account so let me clear my cookies and then uh, i will try on it all right so when you will click on a uh, register button so you will see these option you have to type your email password and confirm the password and then click on i am not robot so let me complete this step it says uh, in order to account with us you need to verify your email so go back to your email and here you can see we received an email from pro free host so open it and simply click on activate account button so our account will be activated after activation we need to create another account for hosting the account which we created now this was for registration purpose and now uh, the account we are going to create this will be for c panel which means for your hosting uh, control panel so click on create new account and uh, type your domain name you can choose your domain extension from here they just provide uh, these two extension dot you can see and dot dot com so as i already said there's this hosting purpose and this domain purpose is just for learning you can learn many cms and many other things and you can experiment on any website and any script or anything you want to upload on an online server so you can do by using this website so now let's say uh, fm tools or just i will say fmt so choose your password use same password which you have used for a main registration purpose again click on i'm not a robot then click create okay first of all you will need to click on check now button because i didn't check that's why uh, this give me this error so you have to type your na domain name and then click on check now button it says congratulations this domain is available so now give the password click create and our account is cpanel account i mean created you can see now what you have to do is click on accounts and uh, now click on this uh, gear icon setting gear icon cp control panel click continue so you will be logged into this control panel from where you can install and i mean from where you can uh, access all other uh, options like in a normal cpanel so here you can see your subdomain 
uh, details your bandwidth your disk space and all other things so you can also actually check and you can learn cpanel using this website because the uh, this website provide many options in free package as you can see here so now what we have to do is for installation wordpress or any script any cms we have to find software and service tab and after that we need to click on software clause this is application software clause okay all right after clicking on that you can see there are many options many script timing which we can install on this free web hosting so this is the main purpose of free hosting you can learn and you can use these all almost uh, uh, scripts and you can experiment on any of this so one of my favorite is wordpress and uh, whm cs so you should try these two cms now click on install any of cms which you want to install in this case i want to install wordpress of course i need to click on install and then again click on install leave these details as it simply remove in directory leave it blank and write any details for your website name description uh, website description and give this let me hide the password and give username it will be username for your wordpress website whenever you want to upload a theme whenever you want to upload a plugin or want to post or anything uh, you need to do in your wordpress so you will need this password and this username so you can use any of these i will just say admin is perfect and memoryable for me password i will use same password so i can remember it easily and uh, you can use any theme from here but just ignore it because we can install we can add new custom theme in our, our wordpress later name so now click on install it takes 10 to 20 seconds and installation successfully completed now as you can see it says your installation is, is completed and this is your website url and this is administrative url which means if i want to log into my website so i need this web uh, url i mean i need www.mywebsite.com and then slash forward slash vp dash admin so you can save this url whenever you want to log in in your wordpress website first of all let me check this that it's working or not yeah it is working so this is a website that we have installed so now if you want to log in click on administrative url first time this will not ask you any details like admin or password etc but whenever you uh, delete your cookies or if you change your browser so it will ask you admin and password so you have to put that admin username and password now as you can see this is a complete uh, website you can install theme from here appearness and theme okay you can add plugin from here and whatever you want you can do here because this is a complete website you can customize it and you can do anything like people doing uh, premium hosting so i hope you will understand on this tutorial and uh, after following and implementing these all steps which i have shown you in this tutorial you will be able to get a free hosting and then I hope you will uh, learn something new using this free hosting. Kindly subscribe to my channel for more update tutorials.